In this tutorial, we are going to show you how to make an amorphous material using Medea's Amorphous Builder. We'll use an isobutyl molecule as an example and build a box of amorphous isobutyls. First, under the Builder, choose Amorphous Materials. This will bring up the Amorphous Builder window. Under the Component, we can add the isobutyl window that we have active in the Medea window. We can build a number of these molecules. Here I will enter 50. And you can choose the geometry of these cells by choosing bulk cell or layer. And here I'll choose bulk cell. And then specify the density to any number. Let's put in 0.8 here. Hit the refresh button and a preview of the final cell dimensions is in the gray box. We can choose temperature of the amorphous material and click OK. This is the amorphous isobutyl we just made. Under the Amorphous Builder, we can also specify a layered geometry. We first choose a layered geometry and then specify the cell with density and A and B widths. Click Refresh to preview the dimensions. Next, specify the cell with A, B, and C widths. Increase the C width by 20 for the vacuum space. Click OK. And in this way, we can make an amorphous material with surfaces along the Z direction. In our next video, we will show you how to build a polymer.